Hoodies are such a huge essential in men's fashion. In fact, most guys already have a hoodie in their wardrobe, but that's exactly what makes it so important to know how to properly style a hoodie. So today, that's exactly what I'm gonna be going over, the best and proper way to style a hoodie. But first of all, let's just talk about hoodies. So I personally like my hoodies a little bit oversized, but there definitely is a good balance of hoodies that are just way too big for you and hoodies that are way too tight. I used to wear hoodies that were too tight just because I thought that like slim fit was kind of the key to looking good in men's fashion. And I thought hoodies were the same exact way, but apparently not because I knew there was something off about the hoodies that I was wearing, but I couldn't really tell exactly what it was. But now I realized that those hoodies were just way too small for me. It doesn't look good when your hoodies are hugging you, but some slim fit hoodies definitely do have their place, especially when you're trying to layer. That could look good, just make sure it's not too small. But just in general, there's not really a whole lot that you could do with hoodies. And that's exactly why I like them so much. They're really simple. There's not too much that you could do with it, which means you really shouldn't be overthinking the way you're wearing your hoodies. It's actually very simple. It's very easy to style, so without wasting any more time, here's the best way to style a hoodie. So let's just start off with the easy one, get it out the way. By itself, looks so good. Obviously, it's the most simple way to wear it because it's literally just there. A hoodie with nothing over it looks just as good. So if you're just starting off into men's fashion and you're getting out of your comfort zone and you're taking things slow, this is probably where I would start. But the next way that I could recommend to you is just as easy and it looks even better, and that is going to be with a flannel. Now, this is probably my favorite way to wear a hoodie because it's so simple, it's cozy, and it looks just as good there's just something about flannels and hoodies together they definitely do belong with each other so obviously it depends on the colors that you're going for obviously but for this video and this example the hoodie that I picked up it's an oversized hoodie from Hollister probably been my go-to hoodie lately I love the color it's perfect for the fall so this is gonna be the one I'm gonna be using so again by itself it looks just as good but if you want to upgrade it and you want to make it look just that much nicer throwing a flannel over your hoodie is going to look really good and then the next thing that you need to properly style a hoodie is going to be the right sneakers but the only problem is getting the right sneakers it is so annoying and hard to get the right sneakers especially the sneakers that you want the ones that everybody is wearing because if you're just like me all these sneakers look so good to you but there is zero chance you're gonna pay that resale price of three times more than what the actual sneaker cost so that's exactly where today's video sponsor comes in secured community this is the easiest and best ways that you can get your hands on the sneakers that everybody is wearing but for a retail price. If you use the promo code Aaron and the link in the description, you can get it for 50% off your first month. Pretty much as soon as you sign up for Secured Community, you get access to the Discord where the entire sneaker community is here, as well as monitors who are on lookout for new restocks every single day. And then you also get access to so much more. You get an entire calendar of what sneakers are coming out this month, this week, this day. You could enter raffles on here. You could enter the drops. It's pretty much everything you need all in one place. So I have been using it a lot recently to check out which sneakers are coming up also another thing that i'm very excited to start using is going to be their bots as soon as you sign up for secured you already get access to some bots so pretty much these bots are going to make your life so much easier when it comes to entering these raffles and, and getting these sneakers for retail price because with a simple click of a button you could enter all your information so that way you can check out as fast as possible and you could beat all the other people who are so competitive on getting these sneakers so like i said check out the link in the description to get your first month 50 percent off and that way you can start getting your hands on the sneakers that you've always wanted. The next thing that you can throw on is exchanging that flannel and throwing on a denim jacket. That also looks just as good. It's very simple, it's very clean. If anything, this is probably the most common way because this look is really classic, just a denim jacket over a hoodie. It's simple, it's clean. Most people will like to wear their hoodies like that. So if you haven't tried something like that, I definitely recommend that you do. Now, those two are really the pieces that I usually stick with. Of course, a lot of people like to throw on more things on top of their hoodies. I know a lot of people like to throw on bomber jackets or literally any type of jacket. You can throw on on top of a hoodie, it's going to look good. But since we're keeping things simple for today, those two pieces are gonna be the ones that I recommend because those are the pieces that I personally stick with. Now let's move on to the bottom pieces because again, there's not much that you could do on top, but there is a lot more that you could do with the bottom. So the first thing that you could throw on to match with your hoodie is going to be some jeans. Now when it comes to jeans, you could definitely play around with a little bit more because they could be more slim fit jeans. They could be baggy jeans. It all depends on what you like more. Now when it comes to wearing an oversized hoodie, I like to wear some more baggier jeans just because I personally am not that big of a fan of wearing some oversized clothes on top and some kind of more skinnier pieces on the bottom. So skinny jeans with an oversized hoodie 
I'm not really a big fan of, but that's just my personal opinion. And then of course, colors are also very important, whether it be light wash, black, or dark wash. But that's why I always talk about versatility because if you're wearing like a black hoodie or even the hoodie that I'm wearing right now, you can throw on any type of color of jeans that you want and it's going to look good. Anyways, the next thing that you throw on that's going to look good with your hoodie is going to be some cargo pants. Now this is probably more on the trendy side of men's fashion, just because cargo pants are a huge trend right now. One of my favorite ways to wear this trend is going to be with the hoodie, so that's why I'm throwing it on the list. Especially if it's a more oversized hoodie, I think cargo pants work really well with that. So that's why I'm such a big fan of it. If you have no idea where to get cargo pants, I really recommend checking out Paxin, Uniqlo, and H&M. These three places sell some really good cargo pants for an affordable price because I have seen other brands that sell cargo pants for an insane price tag but since in this channel i teach you that money does not equal style you don't have to drop a ton of money on new clothes that's exactly why i'm recommending the affordable places by the way if that sounds interesting to you and if you haven't subscribed already make sure to do that but anyways the next piece that i'm going to be telling you that looks good with your hoodies and is a really good way to style them is going to be some sweatpants now that doesn't really mean some really baggy sweatpants because i feel like sweatpants should be a little bit more tapered and then the whole sweatpants with hoodie thing does look a little bit more dressed down, a little bit more bummy, but I personally am a big fan of the whole bummy look. I know a lot of people think that just because you're into men's fashion doesn't mean you can't dress bummy, that you have to dress up every single day. I personally disagree with that. There's some days where I just don't feel like dressing up, and on those days, the first thing that I'm gonna be wearing is a hoodie with sweatpants. So like I said, I personally believe that they should be tailored. But anyways, the next piece that I recommend when you're wearing a hoodie is going to be some shorts. Now again, when it comes to shorts, they definitely should not be below the knee i'm a big fan of five inch inseams but as long as they're above the knee that's going to be fine and again this is something that not a lot of people do because a lot of people think that you can't wear shorts with hoodies but again i disagree i think it looks really good as well now this is something that i would wear on a day that's not really cold because if i'm freezing obviously there's zero chance that i'm going to be wearing some shorts but again if it's hot there's zero chance i'm going to be wearing a hoodie so there is a good balance in between these two it just all depends on the weather it depends on what you're feeling and then of course it all depends on the hoodie that you're wearing but anyways those are the best ways to style a hoodie in my opinion that's exactly what i do to try to make a hoodie look as best as possible but anyways i hope this video did help you out and if it did make sure to leave a like i would really appreciate it if you haven't subscribed already like i said in this channel i simplify men's fashion so here's a button for you to do that right here and if you want to learn more right away here are a few videos that i think could really help you out but anyways other than that i hope you have a great rest of your day and i'll see you in the next video later